Hey there, um, this is a small hedgehog mushroom in the Hiddenum genus. Hedgehogs are one of my all-time favorite uh, edible mushrooms. They're nice and firm. They have a sort of uh, subtle but slightly nutty flavor to them. Uh, I also recommend them as like the top couple of mushrooms for beginners to learn to identify and gather in the wild. Uh, they uh, are really distinctive for their identification features, especially when you are talking about mushrooms that grow on the ground in the woods, which these do. So a lot of your woodland mushrooms are uh, mycorrhizal, symbiotes, living with uh, tree and plant partners and hidden uh, mushrooms do the same but uh, you know those guild mushrooms are so varied and there's so many of them it can be really overwhelming if you're just getting started uh, foraging for food so as a way of um, not becoming too daunted I uh, highly recommend you get to know this mushroom. So um, reasonably common, you will find it in small colonies, usually three to five individuals. Um, a, they co-occur a lot with beech trees and oak, uh, so I find them typically in my chanterelle spots. Um, besides this sort of lovely uh, color that they have, which is a sort of creamy, um, you know, uh, a cream color and then uh, with uh, stains and highlights of orange in places where the uh, mushroom has been damaged. The most distinguishing feature is that it does not have gills, it has little teeth. And so what I was just saying with all those woodland mushrooms, there's just a gazillion, you know, um, sort of brown to pale gilled mushrooms, and some of them are edible and some of them are toxic. But as luck would have it, the only uh, sort of creamy colored toothed mushroom out there is uh, the group of hidden mushrooms that are ever so delicious. Uh, so yeah, I highly recommend that you get to know this one. Um, they do get much larger. This is uh, just a small uh, specimen. Additionally, I just call it Hiddenum at this point. Uh, you might see this described as Hiddenum rapandum in older identification field guides. But uh, it turns out that Hiddenum rapandum is just a European species. There is a very long paper that uh, outlines the different Hiddenums that we have in North America that I have not read. And so um, until that time comes, I'm just going to call it Hiddenum species and uh, then specify that I am in North America. I call it a hedgehog mushroom and I plan to eat it.